body you can. And I will listen to other instrumentalists outside okay. of guitar. Okay, yeah, I can't even I see Dave. I don't listen to a lot of guitar Man. players. Not a lot of them. But you on live? Who's on there? Dave? Chris Dave? No, 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 Chris ain't up there. But yeah, listen, just keep sponging, man. Because you got ears already. That's too much, uh, Diddy Doodle. That's what I would say. And, and um, definitely, I would listen to some quartet, too. Because those guys, like, um, your dad said you like a lot of rock. And rock is great, but... Rock is more so soloing and power chords and stuff like right? Yeah. But with the quartet, you're gonna get easy with the say recording. You're gonna get chord recording stuff, and then you can start to solo within those those chords. And the thing about quartet, what was so dope about quartet is you didn't have the organ players. You know, you didn't have a lot of keyboard players. It was just guitar. So you take Howard Carroll, Dixie Hummingbirds, he didn't have a keyboard. So he would. So if he. If he didn't want to go up there, it's still, it's still, the harmonies are in this key, but he's, it's a nine in there, it's a nine. Bobby McDougal, that was with this group called the Pil Pilgrim Jubilees, singers from Chicago. But his his signature was. <laughs> one more time, one more time. So you'll get the chord stuff in it, and you can solo all in that stuff. You'll hear it because you got the ears, but it'll just give you even more. A, more of a playground to, to play in, you know, when you have that foundation too. Because like I said, like, like Howard Carroll will go, whereas Bobby McDougal will go. The rock will give you that shred too. Miles Davis, man. I love Miles Davis. Cool Miles Davis, man. Um, um, Johnny Hodges. Johnny Hodges on saxophone. People that played in in the world of bebop, but they were defiant enough to still play whole notes mm -hmm. while everybody was ripping and all that stuff. So when you have both of those worlds, bro, like. It was just like your dad was asking you earlier. It's like, you, are you confident? Or are you not confident? You'll be confident anywhere you go, because you will develop you. So it's not about who, how bad someone else is. It's how bad you are. Like the best you. Once you develop that, you'll go anywhere. It won't matter, because people are gonna say he was great too. That's where that's where it went for me. Like I just I want people to say I was great too. You know. And and once I slowed down, well, they saying that's when that it started happening. <laughs>